absolutely dangerous. Edmonton police worried about this cave they say was being used for shelter after Alberta sheriffs stumbled upon it last month. City News was on scene last month when Edmonton police and fire crews returned to the cave days after its discovery. That's when they realized it had partially collapsed. They say there were no injuries. And so he'd been living in here for a period of time. It, it's vast. It goes in and, and further to the left. So five feet down and five or six feet to the, to the side. Just days before the cave partially collapsed, Edmonton police confirmed the person living inside was taken to the province's navigation and support center to access support services. The area has been fenced off and the cave will be filled as soon as possible. One homeless advocate says with the escalation of encampment teardowns, more camouflaged and harder to reach encampments are inevitable. The people that uh needed a place to be are going to have to go further and further away, going to have to take more and more risks to be able to, to have that shelter. Edmonton police say despite this concerning discovery, they have not seen an increase in encampments in the River Valley, saying the majority continue to be in the downtown core, though they claim the number of occupants is decreasing as more get connected to support services. In Edmonton, Laura Krause, City News.